and fresh from the plane. Say hi to the vlog. Hi. Woo! <laughs> the steering wheel is bedazzled. <laughs> Oh, so is, so is the Starbucks. Oh my god. And so are the drink. Oh my god. <laughs> that is so funny. I don't know which is better lighting. You can decide. Beyond Vanitas on Miami. Is that how you say it? Buen Vanitas on oh. Miami. If you really Never want to mind. Like that. Hypnotized, I don't know why. She got me feeling this way. She's got a way about her. Swimming at 2.30 in the morning. Hopefully I don't drop my phone in here. <laughs> don't, because I did it the other day. <laughs> yeah. Wait, how hot, so how hot is the pool? The pool is heated. It used to be 94. I don't think it is now. It's definitely like, it's probably 88 now, I want to say. 88 it degrees. So it feels like bath water. Oh my God, it feels so good. I, I love this pool. <laughs> Do you see why Miami's my favorite city? Yes. He's starting to get it. We met yeah. random men. We come home and we're Tell in them, Lauren. No, literally, we met random men that were so nice to us. That, yeah. Like, bought us a round of drinks. And Very we're just, cute. Like, sweet and so cute. Yes. When we come home, we're ordering pizza. We're in a pool. Yeah. How does it get better? We had literally living our best lives. Yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, Miami. If we could run it, if we could run it back, and do you wonder if we could run it back? Oh my god, these fries are so good. They're like fresh french fries. I honestly might add some salt. Is that weird? No. What's there for? Hi, so Lauren and I just got a very delicious lunch. I forgot the name of the restaurant already. Mandolin Aegean. Mandolin Aegean. Um, it was really good Mediterranean food. They have a cute gift shop next door. And then now where are we headed, Lauren? We're headed to the Dior Cafe. We're headed to the Dior Cafe. And I honestly, I want to see if um, it's in the same spot as where the Fendi Cafe used to be. Because last year when I came here, it was Fendi. So they must have just like changed. Just, like switched the designer. Yeah. If we could run it back, and do you wonder if we could run it It's literally like a milkshake. Oh, is it? Do I just need a little bit? Yeah. It's so good. I know, but it's too much. Oh my god. I thought it was just gonna be like an iced coffee. And it's literally like. Oh. It's so good. Good. Oh my god. And we know you love a milkshake. I love a milkshake. I love a milkshake. <laughs> Remember when they made you that like peanut butter milkshake at Dilaton? Mm. And it was so good. I was they, sad that place closed. I know, they didn't even have peanut butter, remember? They got it like from a store. They like went to Safeway and bought peanut butter to make you a milkshake. I remember. And they went back to um, the 
the kitchen, they're like, we don't have peanut butter, but we can like go get some. That's why it took like 40 minutes. Huh, I don't remember that. That's funny. Thank you. Everything goes well. So after rotting on the couch and watching 87 hours of Siesta Key, you just hit me with the YOLO. Lauren and I finally made it out of the house and now we're at what's this called? Franklin Fairchild Fair, Botanical Gardens. Fairchild Botanical Gardens. It is nice and humid outside. Woo! Just the way we like it's it. It's great for our skin. We're just gonna get a little bit of nature in us. I can feel the breeze. You for it. Kind of feel like we're, we're in, in the jungle. Yeah. <laughs> like it feels very tropical. Okay, Brandon Fraser over here is hot. Uh, <laughs> I'll cut that one out of the blog. You know what, Julia, leave it in. I think it's good comedic comedy. I think I'm crushing it here. <laughs> also, it's Brendan Fraser. Ah, uh, whatever. Yeah, it is. I did read that though, and I was like, oh wow, we really have all been saying it wrong. Mm -hmm. Wow. There's all these butterflies everywhere. Oh my gosh. <gasps> I want one to land. I know. Oh my gosh, there's so many butterflies. Slow mode that one. Fly. Whoa, cool. Looks like a this is hilarious. What is it? Um, Dragon. Fake. The fake dragon started roaring, and that was really scary. But I feel, I feel like it's, it's still, still doing it. I know. Oh my god! Ugh. It's still growling. I know. It really oh my god! Me. Is that really necessary? No. Okay, there's so many of these dragon installation statue thingies, and they all move and make noises. We hate them. Ours? There's. Oh my god! There are so. <laughs> this just makes it ugly. It's a beautiful garden. Why do we? <gasps> There's like eight dragons here. Oh my god, this is. Oh my god, oh my god. A snake dragon. Ooh, scary! Yeah, I kind of hate this. I kind of hate this. So, in conclusion, <laughs> um, the garden was maybe not the best idea. It was basically a lot of like fake dragon statues. <laughs> They and some move. butterflies. If you're into that, I guess. Yeah, there's probably about 20 dragon sculptures that move very slowly and growl at you. Uh, we saw a few flowers. Actually, there's some flowers back there. We saw some butterflies. And now we're on to... Let's go to the Ritz. On to, yes, drinks at the Ritz, which is way more our vibe. Yeah. But we tried. Yeah. We tried our best that could be pretty. at the Dragon like Garden. You show up at my door with some coffee and croissants. Went to my favorite store because you could tell. Yeah, as a matter of fact. As a matter of fact. 